about you know the truck after that because I have uh, I have something a light that's going on telling me that it's telling us that it's slow coolant so I'm a little concerned about that but we'll take it one step at a time These boys are all ready to get in. It was a long day today. We were all stuck in the sand over there and we had to sit and wait for hours and hours. It was not fun. Was it boys? You guys happy to be here? You ready to get into the RV? Henry's ready. All right, let's do this. Oh, Henry's ready. Maybe Henry will be first. Ready, Henry? We made it. We're back. We're almost in the same spot we were in before. We're just about 30 feet up and it's actually level so that's a good thing. Pretty level. So no, buff no buffet tonight but <laughs> <laughs> I'm just thankful that we got pulled out and oh. we're here and so we're gonna we're gonna go inside and get some rest and yeah. all that. Get some rest. <laughs> Our whole day was spent stuck in the sand, four or five hours. <laughs> yeah, unbelievable. Yeah. But what are you going to do? At least it turned out good. We're in good shape. Our cats are safe. Our truck is in our RV, our home, our, our home, the RV is in great shape. So we just spent some more time here. That's all. It's yep. a cool place. Caterpillars and who knows what, who knows what <laughs> else in those bushes <laughs> over there. But anyway, yeah, so... Yep, it was quite a day. Yeah, it sure was. Speaking of caterpillars, there's one right there. Is that like a big beetle or something? I think so. All right, good luck to you. Seymour's luxuriating before we leave. Right, Seymour? Oh, Seymour. Ali's snoozing. And Henry's snoozing. Oh, are you luxuriating? <laughs> Are you luxuriating before we take off? Hmm? You handsome fella, are you? Here's our view one more time before we leave here. There's a muff again. I think I'm realizing I don't necessarily need the muff in the RV. I tend to keep it on the microphone all the time. But maybe it would be better to leave it off and not use it in here. Just use the muff outside for the wind. Just because Seymour did get it once, it's hard to remember. It might be hard to remember to not set the camera down. And we want him to be safe. Or it could get a big muff that will be safer too. We're leaving Borrego Springs and as it often is it's kind of sad. Although Sal so might not be sad. Are you sad to leave here? No, I'm, I'm glad to be leaving this area. To be honest with you, not that there's anything wrong with the area. It's just that we've, let's just say, we went through that uh, getting stuck the last two days ago, and that was not fun. And actually, I'm still not sure about you know the truck after that because I have uh, I have something a light that's going on telling me that it's telling us that it's slow coolant, and so I'm kind of concerned about that. We're gonna go buy some coolant 
now for the truck and add it in so I'm a little concerned about that but I'll take it one step at a time yeah when we were trying to get out I smelled something I wasn't sure what it was I didn't identify it but I thought I smelled something and it had to do with the car and then the Good Samaritan that pulled the tow truck out came up to us and said hey you got I think that's who Sal said it was I don't yeah. remember we saw so many people but he came up and he said hey you got antifreeze leaking so then the guy in the tow truck helped us check it and I think it's at the minimum mark I think if I was correct about that but we need a special antifreeze I think because it's a diesel truck but we found a place that has it in Borrego Springs so we're gonna go there and then we're gonna move on we were gonna go to Indio but we didn't end up going because I mean we're not gonna end up going because it's just gonna be too hot there we need to get back with the caravan and then we need to move on and start heading north so yeah. we need to go pick up our mail right with our p.o boxes you know done we got to pick up our stuff and turn in the key and everything so we're going to move on one thing i want one thing one thing i want to say about this place is there are so many caterpillars everywhere crawling around you have to be careful when you walk so you don't step on them there's so many of them i don't know if that's just in general in Arizona right now because everything's starting to wake up or, or in California. the desert or in the desert in general because in we're the in desert in general yeah we're in California right now so I don't know if it's in general in the desert or what it is but there are so many caterpillars okay well we're packing up and we're gonna take off yeah, all right let's get going let's get going I guess that's about all of the super bloom that I'm gonna see this year. We tried to see the super bloom, but we got stuck and we just don't wanna even try. It just was too much for us. So um, it, from what we drove around, we didn't really see much. There were some fields of yellow and stuff, but I don't know. It just didn't seem to be what I thought it would be. So, and maybe it still isn't going yet. You know, maybe it still has a few more weeks to really reach its peak I'm not sure Henry you're the first one today Henry looks so relaxed right now it's funny we're gonna see if we can get him to walk into the carrier now into the crate I don't think he's done that yet without a little help come on Henry <laughs> wow he looks really relaxed usually he looks a little bit more uh, <laughs> when he's got to go into the crate. Come on, Henry. Henry, come on. Come on. Come on. Come on in here. Come on, you can do it. You can do it. Come on, Henry. All right, well, maybe another time. Once he starts doing it, Cats are in and they're ready to go back to Arizona. We're at Napa Auto Parts and Sal's going in to get the coolant for our radiator. So what happened? There was a sign on the door that said, be back at 1.15. <laughs> so there's nobody there right now and it is currently 12 13 so we got an hour to wait until we can buy that antifreeze yeah we didn't know they closed for lunch right okay well i guess we're gonna try to look at some blooms then Seymour says, if you enjoyed the video, click like and subscribe. 
Seymour says we want to hear from you, so please leave a comment. Seymour says tell all your friends about him. Seymour says thanks for watching.